so I have a check engine light again. Fuck my life, but it is an idle control valve sensor. This little thing right here. Um, the sensor is about 400 fucking bucks. But they said to just clean it, so I'm gonna clean it first, test the sensor. All you need is a carburetor parts cleaner and clean it, so let me show you how it's done. Let me show you how it's done. I've never done it, but good luck to me. So there's two bolts, you can see I took out right here. The corner right here, and this corner, and it should wiggle out. Just be very gentle. Oh, there it is. Yep, that's the culprit. You see how dirty that shit is? It should not be dirty. So, clean up this part. Um, clean up the mess inside. Let's see. If you... I'm gonna shine a light so you guys can see how dirty it is. Let's see. Can't really see in through the camera, but it's dirty. So let's get to cleaning. First, you're gonna want to spray in there. And grab a Q-tip and kind of just clean all around. See that? That's chunky shit. You guys see that? Focus. Focus. Yeah, so we're gonna keep cleaning it till it comes out clean. It's disgusting. Alright, you can see that it is so much cleaner than before. And inside is not as black, so yeah, that's all you need to do. Just get some carburetor cleaner. And make sure there's a o-ring on there make sure it doesn't fall off um, if you don't clean it it can get clogged up and cause your car to idle really high or really low so but my car wasn't idling wrong it just had a check engine so I'm, I'm hopefully I hope this is not a bad sensor because it, if it is that's a 300 bucks 400 bucks out of my pocket but let's put it back in and let's try it <laughs> 